this video, we're going to be talking about what diabetic neuropathy is, its symptoms, how to diagnose and treat it, and its complications. Diabetic neuropathy occurs in diabetics who have high blood sugar levels. Basically, when patients have high blood sugar levels, it can injure the nerves in their body, most commonly affecting the nerves in the feet and legs. However, nerves in any part of the body can get affected. Symptoms include neuropathic pain, so burning sensation in the feet or legs, numbness, tingling, and all of these symptoms eventually significantly impact a patient's quality of life. Peripheral neuropathy can be diagnosed through a thorough history and physical exam conducted by your healthcare provider. Uh, however, you can also use electrodiagnostic studies such as nerve conduction studies or electromyographies uh, typically done by physiatrists or PM&R doctors um, to really understand the extent of the disease um, so that it can be better managed. Diabetic neuropathy can be treated um, through a variety of different ways. A multimodal approach is usually the best way to treat it. Um, there are medications available to help with um, the pain. So we have pain medications such as Tylenol or anti-inflammatories. Uh, we have medications for the neuropathic pain, so the burning, the tingling, the numbness that patients can experience like pregabalin, gabapentin. Um, some um, SNRIs, which are a type of antidepressants, can also be used. And then we have some special procedures we can do as well, depending on the extent of um, the nerve damage and symptoms a patient is experiencing. Um, so physiatrists or PM&R doctors can do procedures such as nerve block injections um, or even some trigger points, just depending on the symptoms, can also help um, with symptomatic relief. Uh, another approach is also using physical therapies. So a physical therapist, um, sometimes chiropractors, some stretching exercises, heat and cold therapy. Using everything in conjunction can really help to control these symptoms that patients experience. Diabetic neuropathy is important to treat in order to prevent complications. Neuropathic pain and progressive nerve loss um, with nerve injuries can result in abnormal gait patterns. Um, this can lead to loss of balance, loss of coordination, um, and it can result in frequent falls. And depending on the population, like the elderly, it, you're also at risk for fractures if you're falling. So it is important to prevent and treat in order to prevent this major complication. Another major complication um, are amputations. Patients with diabetic uh, peripheral neuropathy likely have compounding peripheral artery disease. Um, and these two conditions um, result in loss of nerve function and blood flow to the limb. Uh, and this can lead to amputations as well. So it's very important um, to prevent and to treat appropriately um, diabetic neuropathy. Thank you so much for watching this video. I hope you learned a lot. For more information, please reach out to your healthcare provider.